draw fractions using area models to represent mixed numbers. Let's go back to circular models. We want to represent one whole and two six. So we draw one circle and shade it all in to represent the one hole. And then we need another hole drawn as a circle. And we're going to partition that hole into six equal parts. So remember, draw a line vertically down the middle of the circle and then that wide X for your six. And then we're going to shade in two of the six. Next, let's represent two and three eighths. So we know we need three holes. Two of them, we're going to shade in the whole circle. And then that third hole, we're going to partition into eight equal parts because that's what the denominator shows. So a line vertically down the middle, a line horizontally across, and then an X partitioning each fourth to create eighths and then shade in three of the eighths. Now let's represent five and one fourth. So we know we need five holes. So we're drawing five circles and shading them all in to represent our five holes. Then we're gonna draw a six hole and we're gonna partition that hole into fourths. Our denominator shows it should be partitioned into fourths. Draw a line down the middle vertically and across horizontally and then shade in one out of the four.